Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to explore multiple options of exporting PDF using Adobe InDesign. Uh, Adobe InDesign is a perfect software to export PDF because it offers multiple options, much more options than what Adobe Photoshop or Illustrator offers. So if you have created any PDF, you can surely use Adobe InDesign to export PDF in multiple variations. And we are going to have a look one by one. As you can see that I have created an ebook and imported the PDF in Adobe InDesign. How to import the PDF in Adobe InDesign, I have already explained in the, my previous Video. so I have export I have imported a PDF in Adobe InDesign so let's explore each and every option one by one so when we go to file go export and from here you can see that we have multiple options we have the option of saving the PDF including all the pages or we can export the PDF including a particular range or we can export the PDF as pages or spreads and we can also export the pages of PDF as a separate PDF individually okay so let's export the PDF using all options and selecting the pages and just export it so it will take few seconds to generate a PDF and here we can see that our PDF has been generated and you can clearly see that what is the difference between the pages and the spread it has exported the PDF as a uh, pages okay let's you let's try one more option go to file go to export okay and don't forget to select the interactive from here because if you have incorporated any hyperlinks or clickable buttons so you need to select this interactive option otherwise these options are not going to work if you do not select it okay we are going to select the range let's suppose i want to export 11 pages and i want to export it as a spread basically two pages facing face to face is termed as a spread so let's try what output we will get okay it has created another pdf and from here we can see that it has created a pdf and in the form of a spread you can see that how it has transformed the existing document into 11 a six pages document as we have selected the 11 pages so when the spread when it has been transformed into spread it has turned out to be six pages so that was the second option of exporting the pdf let's explore what option again interactive let's name it as s3 okay let's try create separate pdf files okay let's suppose i want to export pdf as an individual page i want to export page number one i want to export page number 10 i want to export page number 20 and i just want to make sure that each and every pdf consists of a single page so just press export okay and when we will come in this folder you can see that it has created three pdf it has a cover page this is the page number 11 as a spread and this is the page number 21 as a spread okay if i let's name it as four and if i must if i might have selected pay as pages so it will export it as individual pages here you can see that in for in folder num name four this is the page number 10 and this is page number 20.